Well, we are here. We are live. And I got I got a couple commentators with me. Uh, why, don't, why don't you guys let yourselves be known? I like that we're both being too polite. <laughs> both like, no, 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 you go. <laughs> I was going to be like, or neither of you. I'll just go fuck oh. myself. I think, given that it's Team Wars, it kind of makes sense. Uh, you know, we've got a commentator from each team. Obviously, as the voice of Fight Night, representing Team Death Planet on all facets, it's me, your boy, Johnny, just turn to stone. On DBM side, of Pretty Boy Joe Zero Two on Twitch, you guys might see me in chat. Yeah, there we go. We got we got a representative from each side here, and of course, thank you so much, Jay, for the five gift subs, starting that hype train. All you guys are wild. Thank you so much. But we have our first two competitors here, and uh, I think you guys have waited long enough. Let's uh, let's go hop in that round. Just to remind you guys how uh, points go, it's what one point per win for the team. So if you two zero someone, then you get two points for your team, and you prevent the other team from getting a point. And then two ones are handled. The team who won two gets the two points, and then since you won the one game, your team gets the one point. Is that right? You know what's funny? I didn't explain that at all, and I didn't even explain that we had a score screen, but you're completely right. So, basically... What? In the promotional video. The, I, did I even explain it that well in the promotional did you video? Even, did you even watch the promo video? I don't I don't, I don't know if I did watch it now that I'm thinking. Honestly. Man's gonna say, yeah. I didn't watch his Toy Troll video. <laughs> That's true. You, you didn't you watch did. his other video. You didn't. I, I did I did watch Love it, that. but I, I you know I'm glad that you surmised that from me going yeah we get a couple of points here a couple of stuff there, <laughs> but uh, it's it's a good point to raise though because it it, it kind of makes a a two zero more important than um oh of than course a two one okay or it makes um, it vital in some instances all right but that's the usual baby startup where you go get the graceful charity yellow guy and then yeah yeah definitely yeah. definitely so we've got a uh, yellow baby uh, on the I'm, I'm gonna say right on side of the screen. I've got the Discord chat open rather than the. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm right. I'm right. Mm -hmm. uh, Gene's playing Yellow Baby, leading off with that, and then uh, Carl from Team Berserk uh, is opening with Shroom and Salsa. Um, me and Joe were actually discussing the Shroom and Salsa deck, and we realised that neither of us know what it does. Um, <laughs> That's true. It aside from the, the area. yeah, aside from drop to warp, uh, we, we're not really sure. Um, Yellow Baby is quite aggressively built, as as you'd expect. Um, yeah. Normal Baby Chain, we suspect a um, SCR choice is interesting. He's gone for Piccolo and Goham. Um, we've got two coolers, uh, one heartfelt plea, a couple of Turlers, Champer, one Basil, that kind of thing. Uh, it looks like it's going to try and go very tall very quickly. And then Shroom and Salsa, I don't really know what it's going to do. Let's find out. No. So... I feel like Shroom and Salsa, they always, um, they always play cards that replace themselves, or is that only in the Mechie deck? No, uh, basically, with this deck, what you want to do is keep your opponent out of battle cards in their drop area so you can get your extra draws and stuff and then your other cards like right there champion pack one gets already extra that's benefits. a new card yeah yeah right. which is funny enough so the... on the deck list he's got four copies of hercule champions invite <laughs> and we were questioning like what on earth that was about um so it must be that he's replaced them with the um the four copies of this championship card oh championship card because really it, strong. yeah i couldn't I, the... to be fair i did make the deck list for him because he had picture format and i wanted to make the the deck list look nice for the other commentators and i could not find that on deck planet for some reason uh i think i just you know can't it is, spell it is, uh, i was gonna say i thought i saw it that. so like, exactly that's why i was just like i'm like i definitely saw this i just don't know where the hell it is <laughs> Oh, in fairness, um, I'm intentionally not looking at deck lists, so I'm going to be a little uninformed. Well, you can. I was going to say you can look I think at. It's only fair. Uh, no, you should be able to look at this round. You can't interfere now. We'd be able to see you go in in the room. Uh, but uh... I'll keep okay, it a surprise. So, yeah, fair going enough. into the second turn here for baby. It looks like we've charged uh, an eight drop vengeful blow. I don't think eight vengeful blow is going to really come into the game. Um, it's quite a backup plan, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, it's very much like, ju it's a just-in-case, and yeah. I think JS understands that it's not going to be super important, which is why he's gone and charged it. Mm, mm. And then it he looks like he's- He found the four drop baby. Yeah. Which he can now use both of the battle cards on board to meet the conditions for yep. a rival. There it is. That is a very streamlined line of play. Yeah. <laughs> That's been happening Ooh, since Streamlined. <laughs> this man has played card games before. 
which uh, I'm surprised you haven't explained his theme yet there, uh, Joe. About, I mean, uh, we do, we, do, we, do we spoil all three decks? We, oh, we, they're already on screen. Oh, well, there you go. <laughs> Come yeah, on, this, guy, this man's we, never uh, watched a fight night. We, we're calling the police on him now uh, instantly. That's fine. In jail. There's a reason we called it, uh, you wanted to play Justin Bieber music. He's got the, uh, the baby, 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 ooh lineup. <laughs> yeah, that was pretty funny. And there, I mean, like that. yeah. And then Carl did, went less for a theme, more for these are the cool decks I have. And then Sinzino that's, that's because cool he has to play it, exactly. But uh, we well, tried. I think everyone except for one of our teammates has like a nice theme going on. We wanted that was like really important with our deck choices. I okay. I did see that. That was that was one thing that you guys at DBM definitely did stronger with. You guys had central themes for each of your three decks, which I did find cool uh berserk side it was more like okay what is this goofy ass leader and what can i do with it <laughs> yeah i really appreciate the fact that um the really powerful Ooh, what's he gonna call that's the broken seal right that is no, the, it's King no, Sword. It's different. Yeah. so oh, that okay, one you can crit a life you crit a life yep. and then uh you can send it a card from your opponent's uh battle card from your opponent's drop area to their warp and then you can play two uh i think two cost non meki Kabora Demon God cards or Demon, Demon Realm, Realm or, Demon or Realm. Evil Wizard. Or Evil Wizard. Oh, so there it's like go. the Demidra from that box that came yes, out on Yes, it is, yeah. But it's specifically for Shroom Um oh. Anybody, uh, just, just because I'm very, very inexperienced with the deck, um, is there a reason, apart from the fact that um, he's maybe not got it, that he's not gone, uh, the baby player has not gone up to the five and then into the six? Um, the four drop has barrier. Yeah, four drop has barrier. Mm -hmm. well, okay. Nothing else in the chain has barrier aside from the four drop. Right. So if Shroom Salsa doesn't have anything to do with barrier, then he's going to stay on the safer barrier card and then yeah. just do what lives of evolution in one turn. Mm -hmm. Ooh, okay, 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 that makes more sense. Makes you sense. see, look, he's going for the value the here. You know, yeah, it's the vanilla, which is usually when I play this deck, I go very aggro. I'm, I, I do a blue black build just so I can use Sensu Bean because a lot of the stuff doesn't require black energy. But um, that Chain Attack Gravy is another card where it just gives you extra value. I believe it's when you send a battle card uh, from your opponent's drop here to your warp. If they have none left, you also get a draw there. Or when you combo, it's something like that. I need a double so check. It's when you combo with a Black Evil Wizard or a Demon Realm Race or Demon God card. Um, you draw a card once per turn. And then when it's removed from the battle area by a skill, you send up to one battle card That's and your opponent's drop from their warp. There we go. I said it completely wrong, oh, but yes, good. just another extra value because this is a heavy combo deck, so you're going to be sending cards away from your hand, and you want to obviously refill it as quick as you can. But we haven't yeah. seen him grab the Deborah Unison. That's usually the turn one play in this deck, and it looks like he hasn't found it yet because that's a big thing uh, with comboing because he can gain a marker on either turn once per turn when you uh, combo with a black battle card. He gets a marker because he doesn't have an inherent plus ability. I think it's oh, a plus, yeah, it's just a plus minus zero and a minus four. So, if he does aggro down Yellow Baby, I feel like that's sort of what Yellow Baby wants, but also kind of how you have to play the matchup. You have because to. Because if, mm -hmm. if you let Yellow Baby sit at high life, then they can just rip down to two yep. once they get to seven drop ape and minus you a billion zillion. Yeah, you, yeah. You're not, if you don't have a floodgate, you're not coming out of it, and I don't know what kind of floodgate you'd be running in Shroom and Salsa. Maybe Protector of the People is the closest thing to and, that. So the looks like floodgates that we've got are four copies of um, Oceanus, which yep. would, I don't know if that would affect the baby that much. Mm. Uh, baby, 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 yeah, I was gonna say baby draws a lot, but I I don't know. Like I don't think it. I don't be know if it draws. I, I mean, considering baby's probably looking for a turn three, exactly, turn four, so kill. it's not that bad for baby. Yeah, like it puts him on a clock, but yeah. And even like, doesn't that? It's it's small, but doesn't that also put battle cards in your drop area? Yeah, that does. I don't know how much that actually matters, but okay. Ooh. There's the. The TP again. It, ma it matters yeah, for the TP. leader draw. It's 20k crit, isn't it? And he might get a... He gets a something. I feel like if he can't warp a card in the drop area, there's another benefit. Yeah, so basically, almost all of the like higher cost cards, the leader and all that, have some way of getting a battle card from the opponent's drop to their warp. And then if they're successful in getting all of the battle cards out of their uh, drop area, then they get additional effects. Yeah. So the leader only draws if they've gotten all the battle cards out, which 
Like right really? now they don't. The five, the two five drops both get additional effects. The shroom would be to warp a card off uh, like a battle card and then the salsa allows you to play a two cost uh, evil wizard demon realm or whatever from your deck or drop area yeah jay yeah. is going down pretty low the leader is interesting because it it does draw an attack but it also gets an extra draw uh, oh, when you combo and, and your opponent's got no battle cards in in uh, drop so my question is does baby have heartfelt plea in hand here yes <laughs> <laughs> good answer yeah um He's on the two, which means he can awaken. Yeah, it's it's this is really going to be a really sequence heavy turn because the Shroom and Salsa player is actually tapped out. Um, yeah. Awaken only awaken. untapped one, which locks Oceanus Oceana out. Mm -hmm. um, He's not awakened already. Right. Yeah, yeah, the uh, Carl's already awakened because he's got four battle cards because. Uh, John's got, got four, yeah, four battle cards in his warp, so he can awaken. Yeah. I don't even, I'm not, I don't remember if he has to cut down or not. I don't think so, or if it's down to six. No, He's it's just draw turlet. one, flip, draw yeah. one, untap one, flip. Uh, so the turlet here is both to clear the yep. board. Uh, he clears both, but also because he. It's technically I guess, a free double strike nothing. and clear the board, right? Because he can yeah, just yeah, awaken. Yeah, he had nothing else to commit. Maybe he doesn't have. Maybe he's missing an ape, a part of the chain to go up. Yeah, that that would that would make a lot of sense. I'm imagining that he's probably gonna have to, yeah, he's swinging with this first to get a bit of value off of it. Mm -hmm. Um, the problem is that he's got a he, if he doesn't have plea or the rest of the chain, it's kind of a it's a really awkward turn for him. He gets draw two off leader awaken. Yeah, this is true. Um, it looks like he's taking the hit. Down four to two, for shroom salsa here. Okay. okay, three drop baby coming down. Yep. Because it's a bit of extra chip. Yeah, it's what, just 16k, 16K right? Yeah, I think 15, 15 for yeah, that yeah. one, yeah. Again, as the Shroom and Salsa player here, you probably want to delay the Awaken as long as you can because... Sorry, I'm talking absolute garbage. They're already Awakened. Yeah, I was going to um... say, <laughs> the baby player is going to just try to milk it as much as he can and then get his two energy mm. back just so it's just like oh don't worry about it i'm not gonna do there that much go. damage here's three energy awaken draw two mm. which means if he had heartfelt play it's now a dead card yep yep okay swing in well it, it does feel like he's digging for a piece of the chain either that or like he's sitting on piccolo gohan and he doesn't want to pay two for it <laughs> I mean, yeah, that could also be a thing. That looks like a super. It's not Demon God Salsa. Um, he's running the Vegeta super. Um, I think oh, it's I just, he just gets the combo because he's got no. Sorry, he gets the draw because he's um, maybe he's got no battle cards in drop. Oh, I see. Yep. With once per turn, which is quite nice. Yeah, the only is he... problem is when you're facing decks that like burst or anything like that it becomes so hard to draw on that deck yeah he's definitely setting up for a baby chain here he's um he's trying to put him down to three to then wham bam thank you ma'am go straight up to the mm -hmm. I'm, I'm imagining he might go up to the seven drop um offering and double sorry does he have offering and double uh with... offering, yeah yeah <clears throat> Ooh. There is also, if he goes up the chain, he can get into the old, I believe, set four triple striker. That kind of uh, yeah, control. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's that's right. also a shout. That that that's usually what, like, if you can't kill that turn, that's usually the better card. Ooh. See, ooh, he's, he's staying with, with three. three. He's staying defensive. Yeah, I guess so. What can he do with that three though? I don't know. Yeah, he could be online? sitting on. He could be sitting on the super combo as you've said, which would, I suppose, lock out a little bit of um. Repost a little bit would, of opponents. I was gonna say repost would be for two right now, right? Because he only has one extra card in the drop and none in energy. He's yeah, he's not running. Energy. He's not running repost. He's running two copies of Freezer's army reinforcements, um, one power of a super saiyan, and I think that's all the negates he has. Swing with that. It is a pretty promo. aggressive deck. Oh yeah, yeah, massively. Yeah, He's got Beerus super Power combo, super the, the red, yellow. Okay, so Poss 
coming down there. I think it's been used as an actual negate, probably to. I believe he just negated yep. the pass, yeah. Yeah. You see that not so often right there, but. It's a smart play. Yeah. When, um, you, when you have to use it, you gotta use it, right? So. Because now he fears Champa for the rest mm -hmm. of time. Yes, exactly. I mean, not that his opponent's running Champa, but <laughs> he doesn't know yeah. that. No, it's a, you can never be sure. Yep, he's gonna get his double draw here. That's pretty good. Yep. Timbits, the bets have already been placed. It looks like we okay, got all of them on uh, Carl right now. Red. So that's, um, I believe, minus five to leader, and then Beerus is a 5k super combo, so it's a normal one, and he draws the, the Dr. Mew. Um, it's a 5k base. If it's if the card revealed is red, he gets 5k combo power. If it's yellow, he gets to choose a card in rest mode and give it minus He's five. Yeah, he can choose. Voting for Oceanus? Yeah, Probably. he's 100% holding yeah. an Oceanus there, or he's threatening one. Um, interesting gameplay. Does Baby push through if it found uh, the monkey I, chain? I think 100%. I'd imagine so as well. He's thinking, do I even want to charge? He's got that. Okay, maybe he doesn't I can have the... He's definitely got... He's yeah, he's definitely got... I was going to say, maybe the card he's missing is the power booster? Yeah, but maybe. That, that's the like that's the main one to go up from there, but Here comes Oceanus, I'd imagine. Has to be Oceanus. Yep. That one. One, two, two. Oceanus. Oceanus. Go. Go. If he's letting it go. There was no cooler. Yeah. Probably because the baby player can see a way to transition into a longer game. Because it goes tall, it's kinda of got the it, it can you know, in turn, whatever. Just start windmill slamming. He's digging. He's digging, bro. He needs yeah. to find that card. And Tom Koo in the chat, knowing uh, Carl probably has four Oceanus. Yeah, if anybody's played against Carl, you know he's always got four Oceanus in hand. He dumps a bunch of battle cards in the drop area. That's yeah. actually pretty smart. That's what I'm saying. I think that's... Oh, yeah. That's Second good against play. Salsa. Let's see if he finds this piece. There it is. There it is. So it adds a baby, untaps the yellow energy, mm -hmm. suddenly has two energy, can go up to the six drop straight away. Mm -hmm. uh, I would never be able to play a deck like a baby. Being at two life scares me way too much. Well, yeah, it's terrifying. Come on, you, you haven't lived on the thrill Ooh. there. Untapping the multi there. Don't know if that's going to be... Could be relevant, but I, I don't mm -hmm. know if it is. What's the difference? Oh, um, so it it gives him red energy. Mono? Yeah, it doesn't specify mono, it just says yellow energy. Yep. Oh, very good. So that was essentially tap zero, draw a card. <laughs> okay, got up to the five drop. Mm -hmm. Alright. Gets to draw a card. He can minus 5k yeah, from the Yeah, he's gonna probably card. minus Oceanus, from right? Oceanus? So he doesn't have an extra Ooh. blocker. Huge Blocker's if gone. true. Huge if true. Yep. <laughs> it's true, it's gone. Okay, now I'm seeing the leaders. Ah, uh, man. You're finally looking at the immaculate overlay? Yeah, there. I, I, I gotta go for my team, but like, yeah. any man who doesn't want Blue Bardock to win, I don't know what yeah. you're doing with your life. Exactly. <laughs> I love Bardock's crew so much, bro. I, 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 I'm really upset that they never made a surge leader for Bardock, especially after the brought of the yellow I, support. I was gonna say, I think the problem is all the other surge leaders. <laughs> They're just like, yeah, you know what? We've had oh, a lot of problem with these things. <laughs> um, Tom Q, uh, you are allowed to play copies of cards across different decks. It's leaders that have to be separate. Um, so if you run Oceanus in the Shroom and Salsa deck, you are able to run it in. Um, oh, like a going down to one life. Just a oh, minus the leader oh, by five and milling four with Oceanus so we can get a swing in. Ooh, two coolers have gone! Yeah. Ooh, he's okay. gonna. I mean, to be fair, he does have a brick of a hand. But he's on how four life. How many cards were in Sol's and Shroom's hand? <gasps> Empire is there. That's a really good answer. That's a fantastic answer. Yeah. Sets up a blocker as well. So he's not gonna have to worry about the, the Turla swing or a, um, a swing from another card. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17 in depth. He's got four swings. 
Oh, is he taking that? Can he get through a blocker and three more life? I'm not sure. I mean, he does have access to some overrealm. But, um, but they... a lot of it's... There's, there isn't any, really any cheap aggressive overall anymore, is there? That's true. The, the best thing about this is what you guys He's called earlier with um, Carl's choice to be more aggressive. Because if he wasn't aggressive there, that baby would keep restanding. And then it would yeah. just be disgusting for him. Like, there would be no chance of him coming out of this turn alive. But now, with it only being able to swing... Oh, okay. Piccolo I... Gohan coming okay. out. I guess he didn't block, and now Piccolo Gohan yep. gets to rest the blocker when it comes in. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> That's a good call. Oh, nice an excellent show. 45. Are you a combo in that? I don't think so. Honestly. I'm worried about baby's cards in deck, man. He's got, what, 13 left? That's 13 now, yeah. So he attacks with Turles for double. Um, the block is rested, so that's irrelevant. Um, and then... Swings with the 40 and dumps his hand, I guess. Yeah, he can, he can get three more swings in with one card in deck. Yeah, yeah. Um, he's got to be careful. Can't combo with Beerus, that's the only thing. No, he doesn't he'll... have three. Piccolo Gohan's going to draw on play and on attack. Ye so he's yeah. going to attack oh. out of that. Did he calculate that? He does uh, rest I, the I, I may have miscounted the cards in deck, but... Were we at 17 and then he swung lead, or did he mill four twice? He had 17, then he swung with lead. Jesus. Does he play Chopper? He does. At two. Oh, at one, sorry. Okay. Well, maybe it's swing Gohan Piccolo, give it double strike, Chopper. vomit your mm. hand. Uh... Yeah, That's yeah. Probably, bada bing, bada boom. That is probably the answer. Got that up for it. We've not seen any um, Vegeta he's super to combo. combo it, or maybe he's just trying to see more he's cards. Just gonna get he's trying it. to see more cards, yeah. It looks like Shroom Salsa has a pretty low hand. So he's going to get We've a gravy. Two here. No, just one. He should only be oh, able sorry, to draw yeah, one because of how full uh, the baby player's drop is. Yeah, yeah. Because he milled, right? Yep. Gohan comes down, there draws a card. And rests the blocker. He needs to draw. He needs he to draw. Trying? He doesn't get Is the job. Not... It's not optional. He needs to draw. Oh, he doesn't have Chompa, so he's going in with Turles? But he he needs to draw. He's just milled cards and he's drawn one of them. Uh-oh. We, uh, we, we need a doctor. We need a doctor. <laughs> need a doctor in the house. Sounds like a job for... Dr. Hoffman. Paging, oh my God, paging Dr. Hoffman. Hoffman. <clears throat> What's going on? I missed it. Um, he's yeah. not drawn from Piccolo and Gohan being played, uh, and has now yeah. milled from an attack, but he needs to draw yeah. a card before he does that. Hoffman, are you in? Can you hear us? Paging Just say paging Dr. Hoffman. Paging, paging Dr. Dr. Hoffman. <laughs> he's muted himself now. Oh dear. I can hear you, yes. All right. Uh, did you hear the call that they're going on about the Piccolo requiring to draw? I, I did not. I did not hear the question. No. I. So what were you guys saying about that? That he didn't draw off of playing the Piccolo. Yeah, he hasn't lead? drawn off Piccolo and Gohan being played, and he's now milled four from an attack. So he needs to add the um, fourth card from the top of his drop to his hand, and then mill another one. We need a paging Dr. Hoffman him, I swear. <laughs> oh, okay. Even when he's not here. Just, just... <laughs> we need to page Dr. Hoffman. Here's the supers, finally. Hmm. It looks like he's he's only at 10, so I feel like 35 double strike is kind of doable if you haven't shown many supers. Yeah, yeah.
Those are the swap rooms. He needs 35, or... he needs 5 more. Yeah, and he's just got it on board. Yep. Now's the 40. Remember as well, he's also got a... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Eight. Uh, 2 oh, attacks. Nine. Technically he one attack because he still isn't drawn, right? Yeah, he needs to draw. And yeah, like, he really needs to draw. It wouldn't, it wouldn't matter Ooh. that much. Three in hand. It wouldn't matter that much, but it's like... He scooped. Oh, uh, he scooped. Oh, he couldn't, he couldn't he close it out. Shroom's also had the defense. <laughs> he did! Well. <laughs> <laughs> no. oh, I told you, see? You see? It. Interesting to note that um, the Bardock Awakened ability um, of being able to crit a life to the gate and attack does actually get round triple flash. Love it. Really, really like that. Oh, there's the best card in the game. Yeah. You're a torrent. It's the best card in the game. Is that, is that fucking like Kakarot or something? Intersecting fates. <clears throat> you tap oh. one, you look at two, add one yeah. hand bottom deck, and then untap at the end of the turn. Yeah, I know intersecting fates. I love that card. That's one we'll probably see in the like, baby one. You get to turn four. And you just go intersecting fates, intersecting fates, mm -hmm. intersecting fates, intersecting fates, and on tap four. Mm. You've effectively done nothing, congratulations. Uh, Carl with the adjustment here, there we go, making sure his hand's in the that cam. a lot better. There we go. So, Bardock, the neat thing about him is, well, two good news and bad news. Bad news, he's an old enough leader where to draw he has to swing on leader. Uh, which and burst the, two. And the burst two part isn't horrible because there is a lot of stuff you want in the drop bear, especially for Assault of the Great Apes, which is kind of the big play in this deck. But he gets five k. He's on. going. What's he's going right on? for his draw two. He's going right for the draw oh, two. That is, that is <laughs> that is a really good start because that is where he's wow. getting all his draw. That was an opener. Mm -hmm. All right, I'm already impressed. Because this this is basically. A 19k that restands at the end of the turn, draws two, and it's a blocker. Like, it, he it's a fate. value car. Yeah. That is good. I don't wow. think, apart from Freezer's Death Ball, um, that Baby has a way to answer that. He's just going to be drawn two every turn. Yep. Yeah. That's insane. It is oh, unique. So there is that's... no key one hit wonder, I guess. That's true. Okay, so we swap back over to the baby player. Baby player swinging. Um, again, trying to go as awaken as quickly as possible. Huge fan. Kyle Ken cards flexing his bar yeah. knowledge like he's played this deck before. Come on, that's, what, <laughs> that's the only deck I've been playing the past two weeks. And I actually, you know, got, I got a couple wins, surprisingly enough. But, you know, you just got to get really lucky on finding that draw card. Because that is a lot of the deck. Just, I'll draw two at the end of every turn. Yeah, yeah. To be fair, I mean, it's not like the deck is without draw. I just imagine that, yeah. you know, drawing two a turn is... Oh my god, he's... Yeah. And this, is, this is beautiful. Monster. This is beautiful. Yeah. And Meki Kaboro Trauma, yep, 100% there, Greg. If the cover comes down, looks like he's going out of three life. I'm trying to get that double strike off. He's blocked it, which means that he doesn't have to take the life. I imagine he probably would. Ooh. Yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah, he's restanding. Getting an extra 5k. Okay. Don't forget it keeps okay. the 10 as well. Yeah, it does keep the 10. And now you can swing and gain another 10. Damn. Yep. Does he swing at Bardock, though? I don't know. I mean, the, the, the battle card, not the leader. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, no, no, no. He's still going leader. Which isn't wow. horrible, because I don't know how many self-awakening conditions he's put in the deck i don't think any which bardock only awakens f4 it does not have any alternate condition unless you got self cutters like oh my god he's just taking Ooh. he's taking everything um, there. my hands is going crazy jesus christ one thing to note trunks is now uh what 25k 30. 30? Yeah, and that's a pretty good target. Yeah. On slot and then that's, two that's a pretty good target for. Yeah, uh, yeah he's swimming yeah. in. Yeah, yeah I, this is this is a scary looking turn. He hasn't I, awakened yet. Yeah, I hope Carl realized what's going on. Yeah, Whoa. there it is. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. That Damn. That heartfelt yeah. plea. 
That's the that's the thing with these older leaders too, where they're untapped too, where it's just like, oh, oh, it looks like the end of the turn here. Maybe he can untap one if he awakens. Nah, he's got two energy in this deck, which we seen how much he turn just did. restarted. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> yeah. This and supers are now live. Andy has trunks deluge of power this to give it five an extra ten k. See, oh this is what I miss in the format. The this thing. this is what I miss in the format right now. Carl's literally on one energy. And yeah. his opponents are two life. Like this is. Yeah, Carl's Carl's on one energy and has just taken yeah. four damage. About to take yeah. six damage in a turn. Yep. This man's forty-five triple. Yep. Fifty triple. Fifty triple. Yeah, because that's oh, the man. super combo, and then that that trunks gives you an extra five k on red battle cards. Jesus, you have Ooh, to take it. Wow. Goes down to two. Down to two. Well. If he's got Shield's army in his hand, that that could be something. But only oh. or D magic anything. Can't D magic. Can't D magic. He's only uh, got four. Oh, that's true. Yeah. So he needs to be chilled. Okay. So he's minusing. So he's at four K on that Bardock. What's he? How did he minus the Bardock? Oh, he dropped the power with leader. Yep. Oh my god. So he can resend triple he should... and swing again. And then Wait. he can buff it again with combination attack power uh, with 20k triple. I was going to say, how does he restand Vengeful on the triple strike? I thought it only, Vengeful only works on 15ks. Yes. Yeah, he so, dropped yeah. the power with baby leader. With baby leader. Okay. There we go. That makes sense. That's insane. And he can't dematch because he's at four in cards yeah. and drop. And he's on oh Frieza. Lord, what is this? That's a 35k triple. Second this swing. Is, this is why you wanted oh to go first with this deck. Oh my god. 45. Another super. This what is insane. Showing. He did this to me in top Two eight. In top eight case of oh my god. Barak untaps, doesn't he, when he awakens? Oh my god, that's so unfortunate. <laughs> Jeez. Well, let's see. And he plays the card! 20, 30, 40. 50. 65 triple. Carl's just like, I just wanted to play Carl's Bardock, guys. He's like, wait, wait, <laughs> he's, wait, he's wait, like, can I negate mid combat? <laughs> yeah. He's like, I'll take that Come back. On. I'll use the shield this time. <laughs> <laughs> oh. He does have a lot of cards in hand. He does, and, and what a we are now zero in hand on the baby player. We've seen two supers from Bardock's side already, and if yeah. he's playing a lot of blue yellow, he's got to have a better brick. Yeah, yeah. that was yeah, yeah. That is grim. Wow, that is grim. Wow. Oh, well, everything fell into place for a baby there. King well, Vegeta is proud. That is that is that is That's quick. Brutal. That is however quick. turn two. Yeah, let's let's start thinking about. Uh, now we, we have two baby really quick games and we've got mill against Cole. yeah now we see they did that oh. now we can spend the next 55 minutes watching them get to turn two all right you're gonna have to help me with sin zeno because all these cards look alike and all i know that i know that card all right that's, okay, that's i know that that's a great know, card to start i was with. i was gonna say carl anytime he doesn't see that toa round like turn one he's always like behind so this is a really good start seeing that uh that unison to put stuff together yeah. Man really need a D20. Yeah, you know. Oh, you it, need it. You definitely need it. It goes up to seven. Yeah. <laughs> it goes, right. Sometimes it goes to like 15, 16. Okay. All right. I'll eat my words when it gets the double digits. The basic crux of the deck is that every time you activate an extra card, your opponent mills a card. Um, all of the extra cards are treated as uh, Shadow Dragon, and then yep. the Unison can shuffle them back into deck. And, the big and then the lead has got Blocker. Yeah. It's easy. Mill one, mill two, mill one, yeah. mill two, mill four, mill two, mill one, mill two, mill four, mill one, mill one, mill one, mill one, mill one. That's pretty much it. Yeah. And the uh, the whole thing with the unison two is on the backside. The leader needs the spirit boost to be able to use a uh, a shadow dragon extra card for free once per turn. So that yeah. unison needs to stay alive, and that the yeah. leader being blocker helps with that. And uh, right, right. Joan in the chat. What's up, gang? Hey. We're we're out here. We're watching that. We we watched the quickest match in a long time. Besides, obviously the commemorative photos with Big O and Pac Man. Those were 
definitely record time games, but <laughs> oh, oh, there we go. There it is. There's negative energy charge. He showed it. I looked away for a second. What, he got the one drop that plays Black Smoke? Yeah, he got yeah. the one drop that plays Black Smoke or negative uh, energy balls, so. <laughs> uh, it's, you know, he could be wanting that ignoring barrier board wipe. That's pretty yes. crazy. That's, it's, it's the mind games. You're like, which one am I going to do, buddy? Come on. You're going to counterplay my extra card? Well, if he can get Black Smoke down and it's stable, um, he can start ripping cards from Baby's hand. Yep. I mean, he probably won't because he wants to mill, but oh, of course, if yeah. Baby's on four in hand... Play smoke. Okay, what now for? since Shenron untaps at the end of turn so that he can make use out of his blocker, right? Answered my question. Sorry, could you say that again? Yeah, uh, I kind of answered my own question. Oh. I was asking if Black, uh, sorry, if Xenosin leader untapped yep. to get use out of its blocker, yes. and then immediately, immediately Carl switches the leader yep. to active mode. And I'm like, ah, okay, I got you. Yeah, because I believe when he activates Blocker, he can add a marker to the toe as well, too. Yeah, he, bursts, it... he essentially bursts one and then adds a marker. Yeah, it makes it very annoying to get rid of that Toa. And we do see two energy on Carl's side, so that means he's got no Shiannis if he really wanted to. I don't know how valuable, valuable it'd be right now, but no, he not, has Not it. against Baby. Not against yeah. Baby, no. Resist the urge. So, he can take a life with Tuffle, right? Uh, yep. He can take one life, and then he has to, I believe, bottom deck one from hand. Interesting. Yeah, and then the leader on the back side can look top three for a counter, and then has to bottom deck one even if they don't take one. It has to be a counter. Well, though. that, he can intentionally whiff, and yeah, then exactly. sort of he build can. cards yeah. and deck back up. Yeah. thing to remember as well is that the the sin deck can mill you in sort of groups of four um mm. so even if you think oh i've got you know i've got two in deck i can survive a turn you'll you'll quickly see those go to draw and i think as soon as the sin xeno player gets rid of turning the tide um that's probably going to be the point where it's actually game yeah um if turning the tide comes down and you can get rid of your opponent's hand um and then he gets his whole you all your battle cards there. back that that's what you want Otherwise, I think it might just be game. Yeah, okay. So, we'll see if Baby knew that well enough to keep turning the tide. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ooh, that's Ooh, a that miss. Oh, yeah. that's is, is that the only not Shadow Dragon in the deck? I literally um, think so. Aside from, like... Yes, it is, actually. I don't know, Dark Empire or something. And he's running four, so, um... He's not running Dark Empire. Nope. <laughs> so he's, oh, okay. he literally only has that to hit. I was gonna say, not yeah, I think his, like 40 or something. Yeah, I think his negates are the well, they're not technically negates, but the ultimate minus energy ball. He's also yep. got the uh Rage Shenron, and he does have uh the Oceanus. So yeah, he's got Oceanus, Rage, Ultimate, Minus Energy Power Ball. Um because he wants as many things that have Shadow Dragon extra card in them, so he's getting that mill while he's doing everything. Yeah. Yeah, yeah there we go. So he gets the mill for activating. Ooh! That's, okay. oh. that's How many is he running? Two. Two? Ooh, well, that's... So he's 50% of the way to a win already. Uh-oh. That is huge. That's big. And I don't know if the baby player realizes how huge that is. Hmm... Out of the... I didn't realize. Wow. Got the tension with a knife. And the Sin Shenron Leader Awakens when he's got seven Shadow Dragons in drop as well. Mm -hmm. um, all four or less life. And all of the extra cards count as Shadow Dragon. Does he rip anything or he says it? Seven? No, just draw, yeah. untap, flip over. Very cool. So he wants to awaken as quick as possible with that. Just... Big meaty blocker. Yep. Keep that unison safe for his mill tactics. Got baby already down to four. Um. Doing his Nova effect, bursting one. Looks like that was yep. the negative energy uh, promo. Yep. Probably grab him super. Yeah. Makes sense. Yeah, that's an easy pick that.
Thing can also kill the opponent, to be honest. It, it, to be fair, yeah, you're absolutely right, Tomku. Um, the deck does have the potential to just smack somebody in the face until they keel over. Um, and to be fair, it, sitting on seven life is actually not the worst, I mean, statement of the century, not the worst situation to be in. Um, in terms of 30k triple strikers, he's actually not running the triple strikers. Um, he's got the darkness absorbed. The negative energy explosion, the four drop, which is one of my favorite cards. The deflect barrier, double strap yeah. blocker. That's a, that's his biggest card, besides obviously the SCR that doesn't attack. But um, Omega Shenron, Omega Shenron allies absorbed is a thirty k. Um, oh, he does. Yeah, he does run that. Yep. But yeah, it, it it it's not a deck that looks to go particularly tall. Yeah, he's just trying to utilize as much energy as possible for oh, those extra cards. Yep. Yeah. Takes his girl back. Mm -hmm. So she's not loyal to you. Then baby blue is not an easy task with all the gates. Yeah, that's the thing as I remember as well is that you can go aggressive, but baby is just built to do nothing other than negate and then just batter you on the clap back. Um, interestingly, the baby player is not actually running the baby unison. We've got four Boonisons and that's it. I think it's just Boo, yeah. Yeah. Not. It's just interesting because I know that the the baby Golden Avenger synergizes really well with um, the baby Unison. As I recall, you do have to sit it on the field for a turn or two before you get that minus five, though. That's yeah, yeah, too. that's true. That's yeah. true. And if this was like uh, a pre-sided event, you probably think that'd be the Unison just in case someone pre-sides Jiren for the turning the tide. But Boo is just so much value. <laughs> So it looks like I'm not sure if baby players added ready to rumble to his hand there or tried to activate it. Uh, it looks like you know, he's added it to hand from. I um, believe he added it to hand with backside yeah. leader effect. All right, let's see if the floodgates begin now. There's, There's ready to one. rumble. Okay, so for those of you who are not aware, ready to rumble is a block account to play 20k. Uh, negates the attack and plays the card, and then his floodgate effect is when he's played, your opponent can't attack unless they choose one of their energy and send it to their drop area for the duration of the turn. I mean, it stays there, but... <laughs> Sorry, yeah. <laughs> I didn't want to say that at all. That doesn't sound how I wanted it to sound. <laughs> you you said all the words, they were just a little messed up. Just the right right off. Oh, oh right, so here's the... From decking out here, which is yeah, why so he's shuffling card back into his deck. He's going to win the Star War 100% of the time. Yeah. So Baby needs to use his counters to build some sort of aggressive board with the Gokus and, and Golden Avengers and whatnot, and then he needs to catch Carl at a time where, like, he negates, and then you Golden Avenger it, and then you're able to push in with your, your crazy amount of board presence that you've got from countering. Shianus, number one! <laughs> and he gets both targets. Oh, that is beautiful. Yeah. So the, what what happened there was Oceanus comes into play and also discards a Sin Shenron Wicked Strike. Both of those cards flip top uh, individually and check if it's a Shadow Dragon and if it does, you can add it to your hand. Um, obviously, hitting two targets there means that he's played Oceanus, drawn a card, bursted, uh, discarded Sin Shenron Wicked Strike, drawn another card. Uh, effectively made the counter free mm, as far yeah. as cards in hand go. Yep. Yeah. Two so energy, come down. Two energy but he's got plenty of that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I feel like Boo never attacks here. No. You probably yeah, just, just untap your energy and yeah. Yeah, you, you pass turn. You got like Revenge, Big Bang, or D Magic or something, and then Yeah, you you have you've got all sorts. Um is he running any bean? No. No bean. Believe, no. Blue deck with no bean. Shake my head. My hey. head. You know what? I respect it. It's a I crutch. Do, I do. It's a crutch. No, it's a bean. <laughs> That's true. It fixes you from crutches. That's uh. <laughs> I was yawning or else I would have. Oh. So we swing in blocker from the Vegeta. That's the thing too. If he does clear hey. this Vegeta here, that does give Baby his reduced uh, counters again, as for the Arata. 
There's the one yeah. drop. Ah, uh, is that is that the cigarette smoking one? I wish he had the cigar yes, in the winner's is. one. That would have been hilarious. Big he doesn't have it in any of them, does he? No, I wish. Censored. Oh my god. It's yeah. a children's yeah. card game. Come on. The children. Yeah. Think Good of one. the youth, guys. Mm. Have you seen the Bulma playmats? Come on. Yeah, man. I was gonna <laughs> think, think of the children. No, no but I know who has seen the Bulma playmats. It's uh, it's called Iratorum. Um, he loves limited series. Uh... Okay, so we're up ticking. Again, we're gonna draw one, bottom deck one, and then bottom deck three from. I'm imagining we're just gonna put three Shadow Dragons back and drop. It's a bullet. Take my head, my head. It's a blood nut cigar. Eh, fair enough. Oh, sorry, you're retarded. We we're just talking about um, your favorite limited series playmats. It's all good. Uh, nope. One of the competitors later, he's been adamant about playing a nudie leader, so I, I want to see how he's able to censor it for stream. <laughs> <laughs> maybe we just maybe we just like turn a face cam on and just put it over the top. <laughs> I might have to get the Brennan Fraser. Uh, protection like, seal again you need anime women you need to go munch some grass yeah hey that's or you can buy a tcg metal uh, nudie leader there you go get your fix the yeah. end of that sentence was just as dirty as the beginning i was i was gonna say it was gonna get worse i was gonna say metal cleans very easy um but enough being said there we see a zeno <laughs> super combo i'm gonna get step away from the table yeah. <laughs> Honestly. Yeah, so Zeno Super, Zeno Super Combo adding the uh, Saiyan Synergy back to hand, I'm assuming, to just keep a free negate. Mm. Um, does that become a... No, no, it doesn't become a free negate because it doesn't reduce it by blue. Up to five energy. Kale could come down. Uh, Baby Golden Avenger leaders, could come down. Leaders only, please. No. Uh, I, I, will, I will not commentate. Uh, I will <laughs> step away from my role. Surely we can find, like, characters that are inherently nude, but, like, like, does Janemba wear clothing? No, Hirudagan doesn't wear clothing either, uh, to be fair. Hey, we're already two out of the three, fellas. Great apes, <laughs> right there, baby. I guess he has, like, his own vest. He's got about it. armor, he's got, he's got a vest on, and he's naked everywhere else. Um, Cell is so, also... Frieza. Yeah, yeah. Black Frieza. Yeah, I don't know if that's considered clothes now. If anybody's it's looking armor, at that. It's body armor. Oh, body armor, okay. It's like, it's like King K. Rool. There we go. Exactly. What, what an amazing, what an amazing theme. Um, that is that is my favorite piece of music that Nintendo have ever produced. Gangplank Galleon in Ultimate. Yeah, it's so good. It it's is so good. Thing. It just it just never leaves your head. In fact, oh no, I was gonna say um, we have locals tomorrow. I'm supposed to be going. Um, good one. Um, yeah, I was gonna pick up Tom, but I don't think he's going. I think he's uh. Doing something else, but yeah. Both players biting the their time. Uh, snake Steam and Brawl. I've not heard Snake Steam and Brawl. I'm gonna have to give it a listen after. Uh, we're talking about like know. Snake Eater, Yell Dead Cell. Carl having to move the mat is the drop area getting too large here. He's just like, I need Call to know every them. single piece in just here. Just every Metal Gear Solid song right. in Smash. Oh, to be fair, the Metal Gear Solid soundtracks are absolutely amazing. They had a really good remix of Snake Eater, and I appreciated that quite a lot. And I, they tend to come up on my Spotify suggested really randomly. It's always the Doom soundtrack, and then <laughs> I'll get solid. Okay. So. Alright, Toa has seven markers. Yeah, so we can minus seven. What minus seven. Um, the minus seven ability of Toa is you choose seven black Shadow Dragon cards with different character names in your hand, and or drop. Sorry, up to seven. In hand or drop, and play them. I don't think that that's really necessary. Because um, I don't think. Um, you don't want to go wide here against uh, Baby. You want to tap one and try and bait it out with the um, negative energy charge. You want you want to try and get to a point where you can burst mill them with black smoke. Yep. Yeah. So I, I was actually quite surprised that he, that he didn't just tap one just to passively play negative energy charge. Kyle never go for the minus seven. Yeah, the minus seven feels like a trap in, in Sinzino. Master Roshi's not the dirtiest character in Dragon Ball. He, he he has a house with running water. He bathes regularly. He lives in the middle of the ocean, dude. Hey, got a turtle. Oh my god, he's passing with all that up. Hey, I mean, you, you absolutely can. 
The baby, every single turn that passes, yeah. the baby player is going, oh my god, what do I do? Why are you yeah. drawing? Why are you drawing? The start he's his turn. To, he's oh. trying to look. No, yeah, he Ooh. drew off Boo. He's looking for probably Ooh. his android. Yeah, maybe he's digging for turning the tide. That's not a bad... I mean, if he finds turning the tide, it doesn't matter how many cards are in his hand. Yeah, so what's happened there is um, it looks like Carl's tried to minus energy power ball. Um, baby's minion, forgetting that it has servant, so it's... Um... Oh, that's the second copy of negative energy charge. That's interesting to see. D magic gun. Not hmm. like that's crazy in this matchup right now anyway. <laughs> Counting cards in deck now. Yeah. Where are we at? Like 20? I didn't quite catch that. He is running a 55 card deck, so. Here comes Oceanus 2. No. Is he just burning all of them? I mean, if it hits turning the tide, the game's over. I guess so. As baby been milling for these. Yeah, the Boo Unison and he milled Dimension Magic on the last one. Alright, oh, sorry, I, I saw Boo Unison and then I just looked up again and there was Boo Unison still there. My bad. I'm really questioning his decision to, to... I know he's searching for Android 17, but like... He's not gonna ape, is he? If he aped. <laughs> oh. Like, what, what if Android 17's in his life? That's, that's, that'd be really rough. He can, he That's... can pull with the field if he really wants to check. He's passing. He didn't ape. Unless he's trying to force damage through, but... Again. I wonder if Carl's got the SCR in his hand. Because I'm pretty sure with that extra card you can only play from deck, right? Or does it give you... Let's see... Uh, oh, no. deck, or hand. deck or hand. So it isn't. It isn't stuck in hand. You'd still want to use the extra card for the extra mill and the just safety of it too. Yeah, but to be fair, he can tap one negative energy charge, bait out a trunk. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, right? I yeah. play black smoke. Yeah, that's. Maybe the smoke is in life. Yeah, possibly. Uh, yeah, very, very, um, very good point to make there. But the f and the fact that he's. Just playing these negative energy charges kind of quite freely um maybe tells me that he's 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 not got the pieces that he wants but to be fair black smoke is quite vulnerable so maybe he's just not playing it because he doesn't want to you know get it spun or bounced i guess so yeah he's oh because he, he can shuffle in. the back end i yeah. forgot yeah That's we all, really good, we, all we all wow. forgot the power of that unison <laughs> very good i love this Whirlwind spin. Whirlwind sprint. Oh, whirlwind spin, sorry. Yeah. Whirlwind sprint. Yeah, you could do some wind sprints. Zenosin versus Blue Baby, it has been for the past 45 minutes. Uh, it's been 84 years. There's, there it is. <laughs> ah, Reverse Dracula. Thank you so much for joining the Timbus game. Awesome name, by the way. So you can go out in the daylight. That's good. Only in the daylight. Only it's, in the daylight. People blood. Re regular human being. Yeah. <laughs> blood yeah, donor. Yeah, blood donor. Literal blood donor. <laughs> <laughs> blood donor with a normalized sleep schedule. Uh, blood donor. Maybe not a spray. For a love of garlic. Ooh. There we go. Yeah. This is... I mean, this this tells me that the baby player does not have Android 17 turning yeah. the tide in hand. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I mean, but to be fair, they have half the deck in their hand, so who knows? Oh my god, please. Yeah. Pull it off. Let's Pull it off. It. You guys smelling Oceanus? <laughs> I'm smelling one. Is that, can, can, you, can you smell what Oceanus is cooking? Yeah. yeah. Um, five. If you've got four. Is that four energy or five energy? I can't see because his hands. First Dracula is based on Alucard. Okay, fair enough. Fair oh, enough. Course. That makes yeah, sense. But um, we're with the hydrate. What do you want us? We can, we we can't prove we're drinking here. Come on, 
Let's see. I want to see. This is 30k double. He's going to have my with. wife. Easy peasy. You saw what Carl's is cooking. Yeah, he, he, he's spirit boosting here. What extra card is he going for? Ultimate Ice oh, Ray. Ray. So there's another Floodgate. So he mills two. Mm -hmm. um, and his opponent... Sorry, uh, Baby mills two. And you may choose one, two black cards in your hand to discard them. If you do, your opponent can only attack with battle cards one more time for the turn. So this is could, could actually be a really intelligent setup where he puts battle cards mm -hmm. back in his deck from his drop. Oh, wow. Nine. All right. Well, you know, okay, honestly, it might not be. Eight. It might not That's be not too turning, bad. Those cards aren't turning the tide. This is true. This is true. Baby, is baby got two life. Yeah. Oh my lord. So he's trying to mill him here. Looks like he's trying to mill him before he gets there. Oh, so he doesn't take damage from the attack. Mm. Oh, that's good. Yeah. And all that energy still. Thing as well is the baby player is going to have nothing in hand to defend himself with on two life apart from a blocker. Eric, shut the fuck up. Yeah. <laughs> That's right. I, I mean, to be fair, by, by the time I guess the main event, it probably won't matter whether or not you win. If I'm being honest. Yeah. You guys think you'll lose that badly? You got some cool Ooh. decks. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> <you're kidding. laughs> that was the best way to respond to that. That was pretty good. I'll give you that. I'll give you that. I'll go in the next room, <laughs> open the door, and take his deck. Oh, How yeah. much? <laughs> For two pan starters. Okay. Really, you're absolutely you are absolutely not getting your ass kicked by this man. No, this will be a solid two one. I wonder this I'm Mom. I'm glad this is already this is a one one. They that second match blew me away. The first one, I was still shocked to see Shroom come out on top. Oh yeah. This is this has been a good one so far and this is Twelve in deck. I want to play Bulma, please. Yeah, we, we got you covered. Twelve in deck. Yeah, I don't. Unless we see Android, it's. I think it's over. Come on, top seven. Top seven. Please. It's on top of your deck. It's on top of your hand. Deck. Come on. Please. I was gonna say, if he plays Android, is the like course of action just to do the minus seven at that point? Like, cause he won't be able to yeah. kill. Yeah, yeah. He won't well, be able no, to kill. Battle cards and drop our hand. That's uh, true, they do get shuffled into deck. Yeah, I forgot about yeah. that part. <clears throat> Looks yeah. like he passed. Uh-oh. That's uh -oh. that. Uh -oh. That's, that's got to be good. <laughs> oh. That much Somebody energy? That, that much Somebody energy? Uh -oh. He could probably do 12 in a turn. Or, yeah. Uh -oh. I got red. I, I, we don't have until 3. Sorry, just 3 a.m.? Oh, wait, no, you're in my half of the planet. All right, no, fair enough, fair enough. I apologize, Tom Koo. I will take that. Okay, he's got his own Oceanus. Cards of trunks. Maybe tells me he's got another trunks in hand. He's got three in deck. As in, three trunks in his deck. There's Has no shot in your I feel like he's bursted one god ceiling. Hmm. Carl, I'm going to be having my baby any moment. Why don't you want the baby to win? No, for, for real, congratulations. <clears throat> Bears destroys. Yeah, congrats, yeah, Fank. Congr congrats to Frank, or Fank, as Tom Frank. says. <laughs> Classic Tommy. On, on frats to gank. <laughs> gank? Gank. Don't start bringing league terms into this. This is a, this is a, safe, this is a safe space from league here. Um, and spin, yeah. mill another one, yeah. King Cold. Oh, he's like, oh, oh well. Not yeah. maybe. Hey, it's not an Android 17. Wait, was that the SCR we saw on the top there? Did that just prove that it was in his deck? I swear I saw it. it I could be, I could it. be sideways off the yin yang, but I don't know. I thought I saw it. I when did the interesting yin decks yang. come out? Man, have you, did you watch game two? Game, game two was good. Just yeah. Tell me Tell me you predicted what would happen in game two. Yeah, I don't, I don't I, think he was here for game two. Oh, here we go. Oh, he, knew, he, he knew he was in the deck. Let's see this it. Might be it. Any, Does he have oh, anything? Oh. Window one. It doesn't. Oh no! It doesn't matter because he can. 
Oh my Did god! You just one. Five anyway. Yeah. <laughs> it, explaining to him that he's kind of fucked. <laughs> I've been asking me for his visa. Yeah, That's oh. def. Oh. Yep. Don't, don't want to hoard the judge right. there. Tap one to declare it, for and then tap four to activate the second ability. Yep. For secret Z battle, I don't have anything set up for that, and it will be way too late by the time this ends. But. See, these are good ideas it's for Friday 13. Fun. Oh, wait, no, it's his deck, sorry. My bad. This is amazing. No, so when a card, when a skill is activated that mentions playing a card, it opens up counter window one. And then when the skill but, uh, is I could listen solved, to Hoff explain uh, things all whether day. Whether or not you pick option A or option B, there will be a counter window two. He's got the, um, he's just got that, that calm explana explanatory yeah. voice yeah, that I, want, I really love. I wanted to let the doctor... Yeah, the doctor, the primo judge here. Very surgical oh, with the explanations. The Play it. Play it, pussy. He's waiting for... <laughs> the winner, winner picks, picks the name of Frank's baby. <laughs> <laughs> Can we call him Frank? Yeah. Why, why, why is... Why is my sister called Rose? Because oh. your mother loves roses. <laughs> okay, Dad. Any more questions, Sinzino? Yeah. <laughs> any any more questions, Black Smoke Dragon Eternal Evil? <laughs> <laughs> Only if it's Krillin. <laughs> Not being funny, any, but like... Any Krillin more questions? Any more go. questions? Taking 10 minutes to charge because you won game one and are watching the timer. <laughs> <laughs> uh, calling Biza now, he'll get ready. He's gonna be like, Oh my god! Boy Frank! Oh, I mean, I mean, we're gonna play right now. Mm -hmm. Oof, let me hit him. <laughs> oh, he passes! He didn't Ooh, have another what? one? Why didn't he play the SCR and win the game? Maybe because if he doesn't declare... And his opponent can trunks. If he taps five, he's tapped out, and his opponent's trunks that. Oh. That's why he's keeping him in. That's yeah. Oceanus number two. Um, ooh, the baby. <clears throat> baby, ooh. Mega. Still has to discard, I believe. Oh, yep. God, Visa's is taking a nap right now. <laughs> <laughs> this is not that game time. over. This is not game over. You probably oh, another one. No. Counter play returns it to hand. Oh yeah, it was a counter oh. counter. Then well, the well, we play can bottom deck the. You should bottom deck the Sinchen one. You should. You doesn't have to because it's up to. There we go. Uh, it's still not game like the baby player's not suddenly had a. Uh, oh, five and under is not great. I was gonna this say another good. Oceanus is very possible. <laughs> yeah, another Oceanus. Not be surprised. Um, he's also got the extra cards to mill. I think baby's on six in deck. Not enough on deck. No, exactly, exactly. He's got to use leader and at least put one back. Yeah. Yeah, there's the... Uh... Uh, ice Ray, oh, sorry. Yep, Ice Ray. So he's just like, well, you can attack with one more battle card and uh, mill two, please. Two. Yeah. Oh. Kale and a super combo. I'm surprised he's not keeping the Dragon Quake to get rid of the baby. That's the one that can get rid of him, right? That's... Uh, Dragon Quake. Slash battle. Choose up to one of your opponent's battle pick? cards. Energy cost great, uh, greater than their current energy, so no. Yeah. yeah. And even the other one, I believe your opponent gets to pick which battle card they send away. Oh, okay. Yeah, you're right. You're right. So he would just pick Oceanus and continue uh -huh. the swing with Baby. Is this the second Oceanus? Here. Just, yep. Just tap you two. Because he can't counter counter anymore. Even if he bounces oh. it back with Trunks, it's still negated. There it is. Yeah, yeah. and that's massive. Trunks. Yeah, so it's Trunks, so he's not going to get the mill effect, but that was his last battle card attack anyway, so this all has to be leader double strike, which, are we even running Shafa yeah, here? I don't think he has a way to give his leader double strike. Oh, yeah. He doesn't have the unison for double strike? He can't play a unison here. That's what I'm saying, yeah. he doesn't have the unison for double strike, so he, uh, there's he's no... Got no more battle card swings. No more battle card swings. I think this is, I think this is for Carl. I think this is a return if 
If Carl I... makes it out of this alive, this is he, oh, he yeah. gets his he gets his vengeance on Baby Ape from getting Baby Ape three times in a row from Poe. Oh, so he's, 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 no yeah, he's not running Bean. He's not running Bean. He can't um, no be in the unity. Maybe Sing he's gonna check and put a card back from his. Um, oh, I was gonna say he could Zeno, but that's only during his opponent's turn. Yep. Which is upsetting for him. Yeah, that, that looks to be game with a with a hand longer than the the. He's the putting story. the card back, but. Hmm. I don't think that's gonna be enough. Four in deck. Why is he shuffling? I don't like it. <laughs> Why is this not uh, I was gonna say I don't even think Carl needs to interact with them anymore. It's just all activate main. Like, but he's yeah, going for it. He doesn't he care. He's yeah. got to negate this. Yeah, time. there's yeah. the baby hatch. Oh. <laughs> Carl's uh, like, wait, we're attacking? Oh, okay. <laughs> I just wanted to draw my card for another extra card here. Yeah. <laughs> It goes without saying, as a blue player, you only need to... I mean, obviously, it's not worked this time, but uh, you only need to do one thing in order to win. Find baby hatch. Just draw baby hatch. There it is. Mill two. Got two in deck. Mill a third. And that's game. We're going for it as well. That is game. Oh, wow. There it is. Carl there pulls it, is. it off. He had it in hand? Why did he, he, must have just why drawn didn't he play it? that? He must have just drawn it. Yeah. There he is. The man. Hello. The man of the hour. Oh, there's the beautiful <sighs> mug. Sweating, huh? That was. Man. That was wow. Congratulations. Man. Oh, oh, man. That was a hell of a game. Hell of, hell of a game. Hell of a game. No, for real. Uh, the, um, man, the, the, the second round, baby, I was like, not ready. Yeah. I was like, oh, what the no, fuck no one I got was just, ready. I was like, it's done. Ten, I, I think it was. Uh, we started around maybe at seven nine and seven nineteen. It was done or something yeah. like that. It was like <laughs> fuck that was fast. But yeah, for real. Uh, the Salsa run run went pretty good. Well, I was really lucky because uh, GST. Uh, I think yeah. Uh, usually the, he has more drop in that. But like and at the start of the game, I was able to remove his thing from the drop, and uh, Salsa did pretty more. Like, I was really hesitating how well it's going to do, but looks like he, he did the job for uh, for the round one better than I thought. I uh, had the big promises for Bardock, but yeah. another time. <laughs> going to be good. Honestly, I, I, I may be on the other team, but I can't say I wasn't cheering for you. I wanted to see Bardock do fantastic things. <laughs> That's what we saw. We saw the arrival come out turn like on your turn one. We're like, oh my god, he's going to get the draw two right away. This is perfect. And then Boy. JST's turn two happened, and then the game was over when he restood the triple, uh, the uh, heartfelt play. I'm like, wait, he can do that? I'm like, oh, he minus it. I'm like, oh, but oh, I, I, I think maybe I would have maybe got out of trouble if I didn't let him draw and take the uh, the offering because yeah. I could have awakened and negate his attack by creating my life That's but true. I, for I, That's I forgot true. about it you so could that... have also killed um, the one drop trunks when you arrested it with Zamasu but I mean you can't you can't have the foresight to be like oh yeah this is doing six damage to me and leading it to heartfelt plea and then yeah, no, yeah, yeah, yeah. You, no one no one has that if you've it, never it, seen was, it was very akin no to, do you know um, in Indiana Jones where the guy gets the the whip out and he starts like throwing it all around and Indy just shoots him? <laughs> was it? Uh, what it was. Fuck it. There's no round two. Just gonna erase that from the game. <laughs> he told me yeah. that commemorative photo. That's it. Um, and uh, well, this, this, in, uh, uh, this in and the baby matchup was uh, pretty insane for real. Uh, I didn't it well. Yeah, I was, I was like. When he started, he was talking about Gene Link 2, I was like, mm, what can he do? And I and I said, ah, fuck it. I just want to do I'm going to sit back and just wait. But yeah, hell of a game. Uh, just, uh, Jean, Jean, nice game. Was a hell of a player. So yeah, uh, I'm happy. Went well. Pretty pretty awesome. Pretty no, awesome what, a, what a way to start the night, too, with uh, at least both you guys with the deck selections. Definitely a nice change of pace from everyone seeing Trunks, Jita, U7, Gamma, which I specifically told everyone not to fucking play because I didn't want to see nobody, that shit. Um, nobody on DBM is bringing those decks. No, no one on Team Berserk <laughs> either. 
I know, I know Carlo was trying to convince me. I said, you better bring the most dog shit gamma ever. Carlo, <laughs> Carlo had the single funniest gamma list. I, I, like, if you could have seen this list, it was playing, like, the Trunks Jita package and the U7 package. That's... In gamma. None she... of the cards worked. There was no synergy. See, that would, I would accept it. Bring gamma. <laughs> U7 or Trunk Jita. So he was gonna bring some fucked up amalgamation of all three of them together. See, now that I respect. But, uh, there is a I question hope... from the chat. Tom Koo is wondering how you always have four Oceanus in hand. I never had four. Yeah, I, didn't, I didn't have four Oceanus. I bought him decked like two during my gameplay right It's tonight. a slander, yeah. Tom. Come yeah. on now. I don't know. All I was saying was that Oceanus definitely in that first game. Seeing yeah. the uh, two others like, oh my god, he, ha he just he oh, had them true, there. Yeah. True. True. I forgot about that. Yeah. I, play I played Salsa. Yeah. But uh, <laughs> but still, like, the car, the car special Oceanus and Tom Koo special is uh, having, like, three uh, three hatch uh, SCR in, uh, in his hand <laughs> every game. Yeah. It's true. It's true. <laughs> but, um... well, man, that was insane. Shout out to the whole team, DBM, Horrors, uh, Team Deck Planet, and all the guys to the US and uh, European. The game is sick. We, uh, we gotta do. Uh, we gotta get together and uh, have more events for everybody. Man, uh, the game is so awesome. And Zenkai Boost is gonna be sick. I yeah, didn't but, even need to tell the man. Oh, I'm talking to you, Bandai. You fucked up just a little bit on the Bardock leader. <laughs> the blue is that the part that's missing? Is that what it is? I was mm -hmm. telling the chat. I knew it. I knew it. <laughs> That would be insane I'm, I'm just early. playing Planet Vegeta in blue yellow Bardock with those all those good blue apes. Hey. That would be insane. You can do but it. That's next time. You, next you, time. You, win win you worlds. Win worlds. Make your own leader. Yeah. Just oh, devour it. Oh, man. Easy. Just win worlds. Yeah. So I'll start the OnlyFans to get some cash and uh, I'll do worlds. <laughs> <laughs> you heard it here first, folks. All right. So uh, have, have a good night. Yeah. Have a great night, everybody, and have fun and. Let's go, guys. Can do it.